a good Isru Chag of Sukkot 5,777. I just want to share a very brief thought. During the uh, these awesome and wonderful holidays, I saw, and I can't remember where I saw it, quoted from the Vilna Gaon. We say, Simcha v'sason, in a number of, 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 of times in the Davin, like in Kiddush, Atitin lanu Hashem elokeinu, right? God gave us these times for simcha, joy, and He also gave us uh, these holidays for sason, so what, which is also usually translated maybe as gladness. So what's the difference between simcha and sason? So there's a great deal you can say about simcha, and joy. We 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 saw in the the verse for Sukkot, Usmachtem Dikne Hashem Elokechem Shivat Yamim. You'll be joyous before God for seven days. Real joy, real simcha, whatever the word in English is, because I don't know that we have a word in English for simcha. Whatever simcha means that you feel constantly the presence of Hashem. And in the presence of God, and everything is, is, is perfect, this is, this is the sense of, of simcha, closeness with Hashem, and knowing that everything that happens comes from God, and that God is in complete control. God is always taking care of me. No matter what happens, it is always the best that could possibly be at this moment, because God loves me. And God always is going to do the very best for me. Sasson, the Vilna Gaon explains, is, as used in the verse, Sas anochi al imratecha kim otse shalal rav. I have Sasson, I am glad, let's say that's the translation, uh, on, uh, about you, the things you've said, the Torah, the mitzvahs, like one who finds a great treasure. So, sason is the experience that one has if one would find a great treasure. He gives the following example that, let's say you stumble across some great treasure, like a whole house filled with diamonds. But you can't you can't stay there all the time, or even if you could you you could keep all of it, you don't you don't there's not enough you can't even use all of it. So there's there's a sense of great gladness, but then there's a sense excuse me, there's a sense of I can't have it all. I have to leave it behind. So, sasson is that type of, of happiness and gladness which, upon reflection, one realizes that it's not, gonna, it's not complete. I can't take it all with me. And so, uh, the, the holidays, there's an experience of simcha, of this uh, ultimate joy of being with God, but then there's also the sasson, the sense that can't access all of it. So even during the holidays we have this this experience and certainly now at the end of the Yom Tov God forbid we don't say oh thank God I'm done with all of these these holidays. God forbid that somebody should ever say something like that. On the contrary it's a sense of sason from the holidays that as we walk away from the, the Yom Tov sense Oh, this, this, the holidays are so great. They're such an enormous treasure. And yet, I couldn't get all of it. I couldn't really appreciate all of it. And I have to leave so much of it behind. But we have this day after Yom Tov. It's called Isru Chag. Bind the holiday. Hold on to it. And it is really such an awesome day. 
it's such an awesome day, the Kabbalists tell us, that it's the, it's the, the culmination of everything that came beforehand is sort of like funneled into this day. And it is so exalted that we, don't, we can't even access it. The best that we can do is that we don't fast and we don't say tachanun uh, and, and uh, we adjust the prayers a little bit to recognize that, the, that the, the awesome greatness of these holidays is really still with us and that culmination but is so great that we, we don't even really know exactly what, what to do with it. It's part of already another world. And may Hashem bless us that we take as much of this treasure of these great holidays with us through the year and it'll last us, God willing, till next Rosh Hashanah. Next year. Should be, as I say, a gesunte winter, a, a healthy winter for all. And a good job is coming up.